Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Members, this is the General Appropriations Act for fiscal year 2011 and 12. Its total is $66.5 billion, of which $22.7 billion is general revenue, $20.2 billion is state trust funds, and $23.6 billion is federal funds. It has 121,419 full-time equivalent positions. This bill is $4 billion less than the current year's budget and has 5,345 less FTE. Our total appropriations are at roughly the same level as they were in 2008-09. Of course, conditions in the state have changed since then. We have more Medicaid recipients, more students in school, and more prisoners. The state is experiencing a slow recovery from the severe recession, a fact which has affected our revenues. We have had to deal with a $2.5 billion stimulus flameout. This caused a sharp, though not unexpected, decline in available funding. Given all these realities, we have had to make tough choices to bring this budget into balance. This budget is balanced within the revenues available to us. This level of appropriations allows for over $2.2 billion in reserves, combining unallocated general revenue, the Budget Stabilization Fund, and the Lawton Childs Endowment Fund. Most importantly, this budget is balanced without increased taxes. Our proposed GAA is a reality-based budget which prioritizes education, health care, and public safety, despite reductions that have been made to bring us into balance. I believe that it is a budget that continues to fund the core elements of government. 